Hello and welcome to another Promise of the Bible. Did you know there is something that God cannot do? Yes, you heard that right. God cannot lie. And because he cannot lie, we can trust completely in what his word says. So let us read Numbers chapter 23, reading from verse 19. God is not a man that he should lie nor a son of man, that he should repent. Has he said, and will he not do? Or has he spoken, and will he not make it good? Behold, I have received a command to bless. He has blessed, and I cannot reverse it. Hallelujah. Now reading Hebrews chapter 6 from verse 13. For when God made a promise to Abraham, because he could not swear by no one greater, he swore by himself, saying, Surely blessing I will bless you, and multiplying I will multiply you. And so, after he had patiently endured, he obtained the promise. For men indeed swear by the greater, and an oath for confirmation is for them an end of all dispute. Thus God, determining to show more abundantly to the heirs of promise the immutability of his counsel, confirmed it by an oath, that by two immutable things in which it is impossible for God to lie, we might have strong consolation who have fled for refuge to lay hold of the hope set before us. Hallelujah! God has blessed and he cannot reverse it because God keeps his word, he keeps his promises and God doesn't lie. So let's continue to trust him and to accept that his word is true and he is faithful to keep his word to us today. May the Lord bless you in whatever you're doing today and I will see you tomorrow for another Promise of the Bible.